So welcome everyone and let's talk about apps and more specifically how to trust apps on iOS on iOS 16 because it's the latest version. Of course, if you download apps from the App Store, the regular ones, then you don't need to like trust them or anything because they went through the process of App Store, so they are authenticated. Apple already checked out uh, those apps and made sure that they are like safe and stuff, so you don't need to worry about that. You don't need to like trust any apps that you can find on uh, the App Store. The problem is when you're downloading some third party apps outside of the App Store, so you go to Safari and download some kind of Tweakbox or something. So if you install, for example, something like Tweakbox, you can see you can download it for Android and you can see download link one, you can see allow and the profile has been downloaded. That means that the app has sort of been downloaded on the iPhone, but you have to trust it in the settings. So you're gonna go to the settings, then go to the uh, general, not the control center in general. And in the older versions of iOS, in the iOS 14, it was already here, like uh, it was called profiles and device management. Now it's just the VPN and device management. Now if you click on it, you can see here is the profile. So downloaded profiles is the tweak box. I'm gonna have to tap on it, I can remove it or I can install it. But as you can see, it's not assigned. That means that it's not official from Apple. Uh, the iPhone has no idea what it's about. So you should only do this with trusted developers or some apps that you know for sure that are not gonna harm your device. Click on install, then you can see the profile is not signed and click on install again. One more time with the red font to like warn you. And now it's done. If you hit done, you can see here are uh, all of the uh, configuration profiles and tweak box is the only one. Now, if I come back, you can see that here is uh, the app on uh, the home screen. So we uh, successfully authenticated it or made sure that it's safe. We put trust order. We, we now trust this app so you can open it up. And now whatever you decided or whatever the app is about, you're going to have access to every single thing. So we pretty much achieved what we wanted to achieve. And this is how you can trust any app, no matter what, what it is, it doesn't have to be tweak box. I'm pretty sure that if you download something in here, then you're going to have to do it with every single app that you download it from the tweak box, or it can be something else. It can be, for example, a beta software uh, profile or something. It's always going to be somewhere in the section in here. So it's always going to be somewhere around here. So in the VPN and device management, there is going to be a profile. Now I can just delete and remove the profile like this and now i don't have the app in here anymore so you can also reverse the process if you no longer want to have the app on your home screen so this is how it works it's pretty simple and yeah that's all of the stuff that i think you should know about thanks a lot for watching check out the video right here and also subscribe to fox tag youtube channel thanks a lot see you guys later in the future